Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernardo from the BJ Tech News. In this video, guys, I want to show you how to make that F8 key work for safe mode in Windows 8. You remember back in the old days when we used to press F8 and we had all those options like safe mode, safe mode with networking, safe mode with command prompt. Um, Windows 8 completely removed that because they wanted to use the modern UI version of it. I think in one of my episodes I show you guys how to use the modern UI, how to restore and as well as reset your machine. But I'm going to show you guys how to bring back the F8 so you can take advantage of using the safe mode features. So right now I have a Windows 8 virtual machine. I'm going to power it up and <coughs> I'm clicking inside of it and pressing F8 so I could get into it and nothing. I'm literally clicking to press F8 and I cannot get in at all. So once this Windows 8 machine is up and running, I'm going to log in and I'm going to show you the trick to get that F8 key to, it, to work. And we're back. Uh, finally loaded up. I'm going to log into my machine. And once I'm logged in, I'm going to go to my desktop, and you want to do a Windows X, as in X-Ray. And you want to do a command prompt admin. Hit yes on that. Now, like always, guys, I always have notes. So this is how you turn it on, and this is how you turn it off. So these notes, I'm going to place it at the description part of the video, so you guys could go check it out. Uh, I'm going to copy this. I'm going to copy this bad boy, and I'm going to paste it and I'm going to hit enter operation is completed awesome so I'm gonna exit out and I'm going to reboot my machine and I'm going to press on F8 it's restarting I'm pressing F8 and clicking on the virtual machine and there it goes uh, the advanced boot options of pressing F8 has showed up so I'm able to use safe mode safe mode networking some of the familiar stuff that we have used with Windows 7 Vista Windows XP uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this uh, video. If you have any questions or any concerns, um, hey, shoot me a comment below and let me think. Let me know what you think, or try this out on your testing machine and let me know what you actually think. Um, again, it's one of those quick things. I don't really advise everyone to do this because again, Windows 8 is you know Windows 8 really want you to start using the modern UI to do uh, restores. Uh, resets as well as troubleshooting your machine uh, but this is another option out there uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video please give me thumbs up please subscribe please leave comments below and I catch you guys later peace out